Hey y'all, I'm Destiny. And I'm Jarvis. Hey, I'm Q. I'm Evan. And today we're gonna to be trying some Korean and American Southern fried chicken. I am from Houston, Texas. I live in K-Town. I am not an expert on Korean food, but I love it. I am a military kid, so everywhere and nowhere. But I did do an extensive amount of time in Korea. And I had a very Southern upbringing, so I know good American fried Southern chicken when it's in my face. Actually, I smelled it when we walked into the room. I am from New York. A lot of my family are from the South. So I um, grew up eating a lot of Southern Good mm -hmm. food. I was originally born in Korea. I mean, I go back there time to time to visit. Last time I went to Korea, I went to this fried chicken uh, franchise. I wanted to order grilled chicken, so I asked the waitress, do you guys have any non-fried chicken? And she stops for like five seconds. She's like, how's chicken not fried? <laughs> <laughs> back of the line, sir. So my understanding on how Korean fried chicken came to be is during the Korean War, when they had the black soldiers over in Korea, they weren't just about to be like, oh yeah, we'll have seasonless food. So we get to Korea and we're like, Katsusa, Adashi, we got you. And so we've introduced to them how to make properly fried chicken. Talk about where like Southern fried chicken comes from. Slavery. Yep, slavery, yeah. But there's obviously a stereotype that black people like fried chicken. I like fried it chicken. It's very true for There me. are some people <laughs> who don't like fried chicken, that's fine. As for me and my house, we will eat fried chicken. I think for a Korean fried chicken, it's a little less heavy. It's like very juicy and very crunchy, and it's really thin. It, there's a lot of flavors. You know, you could, there's like sweet, there's like sweet and spicy, there's spicy, there's regular. Yeah. Interesting. So, so with Southern fried chicken, I don't think it's too many flavors. Yeah. Like either you got original or you got spicy. I'm excited. Yeah. I mean, I feel like you've had the American version of Korean fried chicken. Okay, well, I'm hoping that the one that we eat today is Crack pretty chicken. authentic. I hope so, it better yeah. be. I will let y'all know immediately <laughs> if it is not. I wore pants that could expand for this very purpose. If they're bringing us food, I assume it's good food, and I'm just gonna run with that. We'll see what happens. If I taste it, it's actually bad, I will let y'all know. Like, I won't be like, oh, like, yummy. <laughs> I, I won't do that. I don't think I have had, like, Southern style fried chicken. Cause I only go to Korean fried chicken restaurant okay. when I, when I want to eat fried chicken. We going to the hood today, baby. Mm -hmm. All right, so we have some regular BB wings. Okay. It's called BB wings, and we have some red hot drumsticks from BBQ Chicken, very popular franchise. So just think of it as a non-spicy and spicy. I'm excited. Yeah. This looks really good. Yeah. So there's just, here's the thing about the spicy and non-spicy with amongst the Korean. Koreans would like to eat one of each. So we created a menu where a plate includes both of them. Yeah. So that's a very popular combo okay. in Korean fried chicken industry. I feel very nice. cultured right now. Let's, let's eat the most spicy one, BB wings first. Okay. All right. This oh, is good. Man. Very juicy. And that, I will say. It tastes good. I want the skin to be a little like crispier. Crispier. Mm. Yeah, yeah, but no, it's good. There's just a key ingredient in southern fried chicken that it's missing. If it had that. It has a sort of spice in mm -hmm. it that I'm not familiar with when I go back to Houston. But I mean, it's still good. Ooh, child. Damn, bro. <laughs> so good. I took baby bites. Yo, <laughs> so <laughs> good. Hungry. There's certain food in your life that you just can't like wait. Yeah, you gotta dive in. Y'all just watching me eat, it's not weird at all. I feel like this is something that I've had before. Family reunions, just like a big tray of these sitting right next to the macaroni. Now, what I have been waiting for, what I cannot wait for you to, as a matter of fact, no I just more. want you to try it. I just want to witness. You want to see my face? Mmm, mm. this is good. Yeah. Whoa, yeah. it's not spicy like you would think. This is like yeah. spicy, but it's like a little sweet. And you can see it in the skin. Mm -hmm. It's like a glaze. Like glaze. I think that's the sweet part. It's like both sweet and spicy. This is life changing. Yeah. Mm. I like it, I like it. Yeah. I will say, this isn't the one that I remember having in Korea, but it is very, very, very close. You like it? I do. I do like the regular Southern Fried one a bit mm -hmm. better. To find this steak side, they nailed it. See, now I'll smash some of these. Are you doing it right now? <laughs> I'm already doing it. Yeah, we don't gotta worry about Evan. Oh, man. Smash it. Okay, no, okay, so I like good. it. I like it, it's a little spicy. I, I appreciate this. I'm so happy to be a part of this video. Thank you so much, BuzzFeed. We have some fried chicken from Doom. I'm excited. For one, it's a black owned spot. They got my money. It already tastes well, fried. if it's good, they got my money. I can tell this is gonna be nice and crispy, mm -hmm. nice and juicy. Yeah. I think it's gonna be good. Right, let's try it. Yeah, let's dig in. Mmm. Mm. Ooh. 
It's always one thing to find like where the first bite should be. This is good. You I'm got, not mad about it. This is very good. I'm not mad. This usually is what you might taste whenever you go to like a soul food restaurant. Mm -hmm. Usually mm -hmm. you got a side of like some greens, mac and cheese, cornbread. Yeah. That sort of stuff. This is also whenever you have an event at like a predominantly black church. Mm -hmm. This is what the chicken will this taste like. Yeah, 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 it's good. It's very peppery. I'm a sucker for pepper. <laughs> I love pepper. The peppery flavor kind of complements the mm. a little bit of dryness and the texture of the meat. Not as moist, very flavorful. So yeah, I like this. I feel like you cannot put all chicken in one category. I feel like you can't compare because no two chicken is the same. This is why it goes so well with like some macaroni or some collard greens. They're mm. all like the same, you know what I mean? Yes. If you have it together, we, yes. got a, we have a party here, Yes. Baby. I think they have, did they have it? We got sides. We got a surprise. I didn't oh. know we had sides. Bro, this is all I was Is this what you're for. talking about, This is what I'm talking yeah. about. It's not just mac and cheese. This is baked mac and Ooh. cheese. It's a different ball game. Baked. We don't want none of that stove top shit. Oh, that's that's really you know good. What I'm talking about? Oh, we missing the collard green. I wouldn't lie to you. Man. Oh wow. Well, the good old Southern girl in me loves Southern fried chicken from Korea, bruh. I think I'm gonna have to stay with the Korean fried chicken. I'm sorry, my people. I'm sorry. Can I just say that I can't choose? Like they're both great for different no. reasons. I don't know. I, it's hard. So based on my mood today, <laughs> which may change tomorrow, <laughs> I would have to go with the Southern fried chicken just because I was in the mood. You know, I just visited home a few weeks ago, so I'm still a bit homesick. But you know, maybe tomorrow. Also just had Korean food yesterday. Ask me again tomorrow. I'll probably choose the other one. We'll see. You know, no matter how full I am during the day. You know, people say there's always room for dessert. Yeah. In my case is there's always room for fried chicken. It's always <laughs> yeah. room for fried chicken. Yeah. Though. It's really cool that Korean fried chicken and Southern fried chicken is so different, but mm -hmm. it's like the best version of those the two. The best hands. of both worlds. Yeah. I felt like the Southern fried chicken was very flavorful. And then with the Korean fried chicken, it was light, it was crunchy. That sauce they had on there. Boy. It's so juicy. But I'm not gonna lie, like if I had to choose today which one I thought was better, I'm gonna have to say the Korean fried chicken. That sauce really wowed me. I don't think I've ever had that on any fried chicken before. It was good. Yeah. It was good. I'm rock I'm rocking with y'all today. For I sure. agree.